So uh, whoever he had to do the valve cover gasket never put that back on. That goes into the intercooler, so that's a giant vacuum leak. It's supposed to be a threaded insert in there to hold the intercooler in place. The insert is just gone. Like they yanked it out. God, this is infuriating. Like, <sighs> no hose on the PCV line. I mean, no clamp on the PCV line. This clamp wasn't even tight, literally just popped it off. Um, the, the, <laughs> so, oil from the turbo seal being blown out, and the turbo's junk. Like, just junk. Like, that's a ton of play. Again, from not having that bolt on it. When they took the valve cover off, they had to remove the wastegate. They never put the preload back on it. Like, at all. It's not tight at all. Not completely loose. They never put the preload back on it. It would appear when they took the coil packs out and put it back in, they like glued it on or something because that coil pack will not come out at all. When I tried ripping it out, it ripped the thing. So can't wait to try to get that one out. So it pulled the valve cover bolt out where the leak is, covered in oil, and the threads are just gone. They're just gone. Then I just noticed they didn't even put a valve cover bolt in this one, which that's also leaking as well. That's just a bolt. That's, it's just a bolt and it sunk into the valve cover. And there's this one back here that's got washers under it for some reason. But like, what? what is going on? They completely stripped that. I can't even get the wastegate bracket off. They literally stripped it. It's round. Back there with washers wasn't even a right valve cover bolt. And the threads are just gone. They're just gone. There's no there's there's no threads left. It's just gone. What the hell? So threads are ruined. They filled it with JB Weld. And look how it's sitting above. No wonder it won't seal up. And then over here, they put a thread insert in, which is right, way not the right size. And they've ruined the threads in that too. You can see it's smooth in there. When the car got here, this injector plug was a different color and I was wondering why. Well, it would appear that they damaged it when they were doing the valve cover job and replaced it. And now my cylinder two won't fire. So now I have to rewire the goddamn injector harness because you know, 